Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of 7 Days to Die on my PS4. I just thought I'd start out this episode by letting you guys know if you're looking for other players, if you're looking for more information, go to your communities, search up 7 Days to Die, Skippy0330, and you'll find my community here. There's almost 3,500 people and there's a ton of people in the community looking for other people to join and looking for information as well too. So if you guys want, Hit that up on PS4. Unfortunately, I don't have an Xbox One, if that even exists. Uh, but anyways, on to the gameplay. If you guys want to see the channel grow, hit that like button and do me a favor. Hey guys, so I'm downstairs down here, banging away, doing these rocks, and then all of a sudden I'm sensed. It sounds like we have some dogs upstairs. So what I've done is I've started working on getting my shit together here. It sounds... Good thing I made all those defenses. It sounds like the dogs are getting fucked up on it. Uh, but what I've started working on is just a quick underground tunnel. What I'm going to do with this is we are going to go up to my floor over here and actually build a forge house underneath the floor. Uh, that way I can take on the screamers up there. Uh, sounds like we still have some company up there. It actually... I. Uh, it's more dogs. It must be a wandering horde. I think that's what we got going on. I can hear him going crazy. But I don't know who's up there. Okay, cool. So we're undetected. It's almost morning time. I'm actually going to chill out here for a second. And we're going to take a quick look at the inventory. This, guys, is what I forgot they added to the game. If we go like this and we check out stairs. Here we go. We're going to go stair. S-T-A-A. They added all these ones in. And these ones are fucking cool. These are way cooler than the wood stairs. I don't know. I just like how they have a space in between them. And you can see in between them. And then you got the ones with the railings as well. I didn't use those because, well, it's not open. And I really don't need the railings. Uh, so let's actually go outside and find out what the fuck's going on. I'm actually going to make... Yep. Okay. My, uh, my bow is loaded. That is a good thing. Wow, they're still taking damage up there. Uh, so what I've done is replaced all the uh, the stairs in here with these stairs. They're just they're just so much cooler, so much cooler, so much better. Uh, but anyways, let's go upstairs and take care of these little assholes up here. I might die. I'm not sure. You know what I might do? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run like a little pussy. And I'm going to aim for the horde base. That way I can take them on in the middle. Because, well, they're still dogs, right? Oh shit, I hit the trap. <laughs> taking, taking a little bit of trap damage. Oh, there's a dog right up there. Okay, cool. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and jump over here. And then this should slow down the dogs enough for us that we don't get killed by them. Are we... We are undetected. What the hell? Did they not see me over there? Oh, look, there's another dog over there. Holy crap, how many dogs are there? What is it? What is it doing? Don't go in my... Oh, you asshole. It's on the second floor. What is it doing? What the fuck? that dog doing over there and he's off the edge maybe they're running in and out of the outside that is so weird why is it doing that um is it coming this way where the fuck did it go man some fucked up shit it sounds like they're doing some damage up there too i wonder i wonder what they got around to okay well i guess it's gone <laughs> Let's go check out and see what exactly happened up here. Weird day to get a dog horde as well, too. It's uh, day 12, but I guess they, uh, they changed like the, the, um, the dog hordes and everything recently. Uh, see, there's one right there. He's actually, um, he was just at the front of the traps. Oh, there's two right here. Okay, you know what? I'm actually going to skin these guys because they're still good for the leather and they're still good for the rotting flesh. Because then I can turn these guys into forges and then turn their flesh into fertilizer oh wow yeah like look at that look at the supplies these dogs give you holy shit um i should probably you know what i have a bunch of bones a good way to grind your um your weapon and tools or your weapon skills up as well too is to make shivs if you have like an overload of bones because like i don't need that much glue at this moment but i do have a good stock of bones all right well that shit was weird i wonder if they did any other damage up here running all over the place Acting like fools. Ooh, I left these down here last time. Let's pick these up. There we go. Always like to pick up after myself. And yeah, it looks like they uh, didn't do too much damage. It's kind of funny though that that dog ran into the house, ran upstairs, and then ran off the side over here. Oh, you, you broke my railing, you asshole. So instead of going around the house, the damn thing went right through the house. Holy fuck, that's funny. All right, 
So today's mission, guys, we've already wasted an hour here, is I need to get my wrench, and we need to go to town, and we need to get our business taken care of. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to top off this forge with, like, everything we have and keep it running while we're out. Because that way, at least then, I will be gone, and we won't have to deal with the screamers from here. Uh, so I only have a little bit of iron, so what I'm going to do is just dump shitloads of stone in here. There we go. I, I split the stacks by pressing the, uh, the square key. That grabs half of it. If you pick up the stack and press the square key, it drops one. Uh, so there's two different ways of organizing your stuff. So I'm going to get my shit organized here, guys. And we're going to hop on over to that city. Alright, guys. So we're here at the city. Our main goal now is we have to get mechanical parts. We have to get springs. Oh, look, there's a mechanical part. Sick. Um, pretty much everything. The thing we need the most right now is an engine. So we have to take a look for an engine. Um, I, I would actually take five engines if it would drop for me. That would be really nice. Now, these cars really don't give out on the mechanical parts, but they do drop the engine. So what I'm going to do is uh, just simply scrap the cars down until I do find an engine. And then we'll go and do some looting and find the rest of our mechanical parts and everything else that we may need. So let's give this car a search here. Always search them first before breaking them down. And nothing. Sometimes these give real good things. They give tools, uh, they give mining helmets, uh, they give you a lot of stuff that you really need. Damn, this first layer really freaking sucks. What's up, buddy? You wanna play ring around the car? I'll play with you. There we go. There we go. <laughs> I've done this so many times with zombies, because I'm like, uh, I just don't feel like dealing with you. We'll just, uh, we'll just play ring around the car here. Ooh, as long as, long as my stamina doesn't run out, we should be okay. Okay, you know what? That should be good there. Uh, let's stop and take a quick look at our inventory and... Oh, usually I don't scrap these, but I'm going to scrap them down now. Uh, the Those, by far, give the most parts, or the most brass out of any item. Uh, so that's why I usually like saving those, because they stack in five. And then I can put them... Holy crap. Um, I can go ahead and put them into my forge in stacks of five and not waste any uh, brass by scrapping it down. Because uh, you do waste brass when you scrap things down. Okay, it looks like that last layer of the car is just completely useless. How many parts do we have? Two. Well, it's not too bad. We took down a couple cars, got a couple points. Uh, let's aim for another car. Okay, so there's a house here. There's another house in behind it. There's a house over there. Holy crap, there's a poppin' pills. Oh my god, the city just has so much useful stuff in it. Let's break down this car here, too. I don't think I've searched it yet. Nope, definitely haven't searched it. And nothing. I'm not even going to bother grabbing that stuff, to be honest. And to stay safe... Fuck, it's so weird you can't jump on these things now without, like, taking a run jump at it. There we go. And now this big guy has found us, and he's going to come over and bug us, too. You want to play ring around the car again, bunny? I'll do it. I have no problem doing it. It's kind of fun, actually. Oh, shush. I know you're angry because you're cold and stuck in the winter biome. I'm like that for six months of the year as well. All right, let's go check out this car here. I think this guy's still fucking following us. That's funny. Maybe we'll use those. Maybe we'll take out the rest of those spikes. All right, give me a damn engine. That's all I need. Then we can go loot the other places. Oh, shit. Is there an engine? Oh, there's an engine right there. Perfect. Okay, so we got an engine going. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look. Um, you know what? I think this gas station is going to be good for... Holy zombies over there, though. A lot of zombies over there. You know what? Oh, shit. There's a zombie coming. And this guy's still after us as well, too. God damn it. Let's drink some water. I'm going to get some stamina back. Um, I'm also, guys, out of the other drinks as well, too. I have the um, the drinks that are made from mums. Are you going to finish breaking through there for me, buddy? I have the, the drinks that are made from uh, mums, but they cool you down, and I really don't need to be cooled down in the winter biome, uh, especially considering that I forgot my um, winter clothes. <laughs> so I don't know how long we're going to last here today. All we got to do is get a bunch of mechanical parts. Watch this guy. He's just going to walk right through those spikes, a whole row of them. Holy shit, there's a lot of these guys. Do I have meat on me or something here? Why do I got so much love? Why do I have so much love coming at me right now? Oh, nice. He's broken down. Let's uh, let's pump some arrows into these assholes. Whoops. If I can aim. There we go. Nice. These iron arrows are so much better than they were, or the, the stone arrows. I also have steel arrows as well, too. We could use those to take out the lumberjack, guys. Oh, well, his head's supposed to be there. Can't see it, though, because it's buried in snow. What's up, buddy? 
Oh, that one only... So that one took, what, three spikes to take out? That's a lot of spikes to take out a zombie. That's insane. And it didn't kill him either. I actually had to go over and finish him off. Shit. Try to hit them in the head, guys. Does so much more damage. Fuck. <laughs> if I could aim. Come on, buddy. Really? Come on, buddy. Oh, well. At least we can loot the store now uh, without getting harassed, I think. Holy fuck. Stop eating my arrows, asshole. There we go, nice. Let's see if these guys give us anything good. Ah, whatever. I'll take that, though. We can use those. Uh, what do we have here? Yeah, empty zombie remains. Where'd the other one go? Is he right here? Kind of buried? Hate it when this snow happens. It's so hard to see the zombies. All right, sweet. So I think I got the... Oh, oh look at this. There's a cart right here, guys, that we didn't uh, that we didn't get. Nice. These are hands down your best source of mechanical parts out of any of the things. Um, other than those pole tops, like I explained in the last episode. So we need at least 10 mechanical parts uh, for the, uh, for the, uh, oh wow, there's so much looting here. Here's another, you know what, I might not even loot this place right now for its um, health stuff. What I might do is just go around breaking down these, these carts and everything, because that's really why I'm here, to get all these mechanical parts. Uh, it looks like it's button hooking me this time. Only got a few. Okay, how much we got? We got six. Okay, so I think like 15 should be good enough. Um, I actually didn't look to see... Oh, now I'm looting this stuff. Um, now, I didn't actually look to see if the um, the drawbridge required mechanical parts. I'm sure it does, so I'm going to go ahead and grab a few extra. That is my bad. I should have done that earlier. Uh, now, you see how these are empty shopping baskets? If you ever need a shopping basket for your mini bike, take, uh, take your wrench and wrench it down. See... That's going to be a little slow, so what I'm going to do is hit it with that, and then just wrench down the last little bit, and bam, now you have a shopping cart in your inventory, or shopping basket, I'm sorry. Holy crap, it's level 512 as well, too. That's pretty sick, actually. That's a very high-level shopping cart. Okay, i got to come back here and search this another time. we gotta stay. We got to stay focused here. Damn, focusing. Uh, these things are good. Let's, uh, let's break these things down here. They'll give us one or two parts. I usually stop after I get one part. Because breaking it all the way down. The oh, there we go. We got two parts off of that one. Sick. Let's go grab this one up over here. Of course, search it first. Um, these are good for recipes as well, too, guys. You can find plenty of recipes in here. Oh, uh, you're not going to give us any this time? Nothing. It gave us nothing that time. That's brutal. Oh, well, it is what it is. Uh, this, I'm actually going to search right now because um, we need beer and stuff. And I don't know how long I'm going to last here. Ah, there we go. We got a beer. Um, now, you can make hops and stuff, so you can make your own beer. And I kind of want to cover a misunderstanding some of you guys had uh, in the previous video. Oh, sweet, a Mega Crush. In the previous video, guys, when I say you didn't have beer, you didn't have beer. You had a placeholder. This beer gives you bravado and st stun immunity. That is why I went on for about two minutes afterwards explaining about the uh, stun immunity and everything. It wasn't to waste you guys time or tell you there wasn't beer in the game. You guys just didn't have this version of the beer. So I know there's a lot of misunderstanding there, but guys, please try to listen to what I'm saying before you try to correct me on it because <laughs> I knew what you were saying, but you were misunderstanding what I was saying. All right, uh, why am I searching this stuff? Yeah, well, it is what it is. There we go. More health parts. Okay. Oh, fuck. We got so much junk on us. I'm going to go ahead and use that. All right. So it looks like I got all of the stuff out of here that might have mechanical parts. Oh, you know what? I didn't get the office. Let's go check out the office. I think there's a couple filing cabinets back here as well, too. Uh, so I'm going to go through the wall because it's... Oh, shit. Well, it's supposed to be quicker, but it's not quicker this time now. I'm making this shit longer for myself. Ah, here we go. We have another filing cabinet here. I'm going to go ahead and break it down. Now, in the first episode, I was a little like, ah, you really shouldn't because it's a waste of your wrench. But now that I can make wrenches, I'm really not that worried at all. All right. So this one here is just a weak old metal door, so it should be two hits. Yeah, look at that. There we go. Uh, the reason I went through the wall is because this one has wood and metal. And I just, I honestly just hate working my way through both of them. It's a little annoying. Ooh, what kind of seeds were those? Aloe vera? Yeah, I don't need them. Um, I am looking and starting to look now for potatoes. That kind of thing. Uh, corn. Any seeds that I can get. Because I'm going to start wanting to do a farm very soon. Especially now that we're going to have... Ooh, how many parts do we have now? Ten. Nice! Um, especially considering... 
whoa, I lost track of um, track of what I was saying here. But anyways, let's continue on. I'll never finish that thought. You guys can you guys can twitch out about that. Uh, let's go into one of these homes here and see what they have. I really don't want to hit up that police station quite yet. Uh, so this is a burnt out version of the actual house we're in now, guys. Uh, so I don't know if there's anything in here. Oh, wow. I forgot about these in front. I don't know if there's anything in here. What the hell? Why are you crawling? Are you missing a leg? Did you hit these things? Is that what it was? She's missing both of her legs. Look, Ma, no legs. Okay, so she must have hit these spikes when she spawned in and ended up up there. That's weird. I was not expecting to see. Oh, no head and no legs. Huh? She's still got arms. She's still useful. Okay, there we go. Nice. Let's grab some of this stuff here and take a look, see if there's anything useful in this house that we can turn into mechanical parts. Fuck your unlocked door. That's right. Get triggered. Okay, let's see what we have in here. Uh, you know what? Let's break down one of these ovens. I'm thinking one of these ovens might have mechanical parts. Um, I know they do in Alpha 16, so we'll check it out here. And if not, it's no loss because I still get the rest of the stuff I need anyways. Oh, you know what we need to hit up too is TVs and stuff to get those components. I'm dropping stuff all over the ground. Oh, components. Yes, we need those. Uh, let's get rid of our wood here. And, oh, plastics, not so much. Damn it. Stupid inventory management. And get rid of some of this nitrate. We definitely don't need that. That way we can grab our scrap plastics, electronic components. Ah, there we go. Perfect. So that didn't give us any mechanical parts. So it doesn't seem that mechanical parts are in those yet. So let's go check out what else this place has to offer. Oh, look. A tire. <laughs> don't need that, though. Let's go look upstairs. I really don't think there's much here, guys. Yeah, there's no TV here. Uh, there's, yeah, there's fuck all here. Oh, cool. There's actually a campfire up in here. Does it work, too? Nice. I didn't know that. This would be a very bad POI to start in, guys. A very bad POI. Ah, uh, yeah, there's zombies up here smashing the shit out of this place. All right, let's go down. These burnt down homes actually really fucking suck. There's not much in them, and they're kind of a waste of time. Let's go check out another one here. Oh, snap. There's an airdrop right over here, guys. Holy crap. It's sitting right there. Is it, uh, oh, and there's a store over there? Holy crap. We haven't even come this way yet. Like, we haven't even explored this whole city yet. This is insane. We got a deer there. I'm actually going to leave that deer be. Hopefully, it'll be here next time we come back. I don't really need the meat right now, and I don't really have the inventory. So, um, that would have been a prime shot, though. That deer was not paying attention. All right, let's grab this up. Oh, nice. I can make an iron chest now. I can make some exploding crossbow bolts. I'll never use them, but I can make them. That's nice. What else do we have? Yeah, we'll get rid of some of this junk here. We'll get rid of leather... We'll get rid of plant fibers, and we always, always take health kits and antibiotics. Nice. Look at that. The city is just full of fucking loot. We got a Shamway Foods. Oh, sick. We should get what we need off of these uh, these shopping carts in front of this store. Look, there's three shopping carts. Three? Four? One, two, three, four, five, six? Six fucking shopping carts in front of this place. Holy crap, Shamway. You are going to provide us with tons and tons of mechanical parts. Okay, and there we go. I broke down all of those friggin' carts in front of this store. Holy crap, there were a ton. He even killed a zombie. How many do we have? 23 parts? We are good to go, guys. But the thing is, I'm freezing. I'm 17 degrees Fahrenheit right now. I'm experiencing hypothermia stage one. Uh, so I got to get my ass home, guys, and into the, uh, the warmth because it's, it's raining out. I'm cold, and I think we can. I think we can make it home in time enough to not have to make any clothes or bother with any of that crap. I'll see you guys very, very shortly. As if, as if it just dropped an air, an airdrop right in front of me in my path on the way home. This is friggin' awesome. Oh, and there we are. Look at that. It's dropping as we're approaching it. That is so cool. Very rarely do I ever get to see an airdrop hit the ground. Ah, oh, this was this one wasn't so good. Some rocket launcher parts, but you know what? I'm gonna go at oh shit. Why did I drop those? Ah well, they're not as important. I'm gonna go ahead and pick those up and then we're gonna pick up oh where the fuck did it go? Um oil, there we go. Oil drops and it looks like um it looks like beer for some reason. Oil and beer have the same thing when they drop on the ground. I kind of wish they would put the oil in. Anyways, let's get to warmth. 
Woo, and we're home safe and sound and we're still getting cold though we're still getting the hypothermia because it's raining out uh so i'm gonna get my ass inside here <laughs> damn it you're so slow when you have hypothermia i'm gonna get my ass inside here and we should start warming up ah there we go we're good to go now now imagine i brought this red tea with me and i was drinking it because i was a dummy and it was cooling me off i probably would have died at that point uh so i'm gonna get some of this stuff put away here and we're gonna go ahead and make our cement mixer all right so we have everything we need on us here. We have our forged iron, our springs, uh, the small engine, and tan mechanical parts. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and craft that. Uh, it's actually a quick crafting time. I can't believe it's only two and a half minutes. And now we're also going to take a look at... Let's back out of here. We're going to look at our drawbridge. Type in draw. Nice. There we go. Uh, so we're going to need a little more forge. That's okay. I got the a little more forge. A little more forged iron. Uh, but that's okay because I got the forge going. Ah, oh shit, we needed 30 mechanical parts. Motherfucker. You know what, guys? We still have some daytime left here. Um, I'm going to make sure this forge is topped off. Uh, it's only 12 minutes right now. Uh, what do I have that I can burn in it? Some more coal? Okay, we'll put some more coal in it just to keep it going for a little while here. I have to go and get some more mechanical parts. I, I fuck, 30 parts. God damn, and I only have 15. Ugh. It is what it is, right? Um, I was really hoping to get to the drawbridge this episode, but it doesn't look like we're going to be able to do that. Um, what I might do now, then, is wait out the time for our cement mixer. And what I'm going to do in the meantime is start getting some nice stuff together so that we can make fertilizer as well. We're going to stash this all in there. I'm going to put my brass up into my forgeables. Nice. Eggs in the food. You know what? I think I need food as well here too. Let's take a quick look. Let's take a quick look. Uh, I think my meat's up in the fire, so we should be good there. And what do we have in here? <gasps> Where's my meat? Uh-oh. Did I lose my meat? Was I looking in health stuff? <laughs> I was looking in health stuff. Oh my god, I'm a dummy. Oh, we need to make a whole bunch of snow or water as well too. Damn it. Okay, so what I'm going to do, because we're going to be home for a little bit, is I'm going to turn this off. I'm going to let our heat map cool down a bit. And then we'll turn it back on when we head out. So let's go to our fire. And we have nothing to put in it to burn either. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, you know what? We do. How long do one of these suckers burn? What? These burn for 12 minutes each? No way. We have to test something, guys. Fuck this. I'm going to go and get some wood, and we're going to put 100 wood in there and see if 100 wood burns for 12 minutes each. That is insane. I think I just found my new uh, my new forge material, um, aside from wood and coal. Holy crap. That's insane. Okay, so I got all my wood, stepped on all my, um, all my traps outside, so I brought my health down a bit. Uh, you know what I can do? I could take a painkiller. We can use that up. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so the spikes burn for 12 minutes and 100 wood, which is what it takes for the spikes, burns for 16. Oh, shit. Oh, that's not so bad. Okay, never mind. I don't know what I was thinking there. I, why I thought the wood spikes actually burn longer. Whatever. It is what it is. At least we now have a whole bunch of supplies we can make. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and make up a couple of bacon and eggs because those are delicious. And I've also went and got a whole bunch of snowballs. I, I dug them up when I went um, and I was searching for... Uh, for iron out of the nodes uh, so we have a whole bunch of those sitting around uh, so you only need one snowball and one glass jar to make a ball of water so you can imagine like 30 seconds of effort of digging with a steel shovel is like a week's worth of water so we're gonna have a shitload of water after this and that is never a bad thing oh sweet look at that our bacon and eggs are done already this should bring us up to about 107 oh nice look at that there we go and maybe 108 108 108 nice i love feeling that little shake in the uh the controller when i do that okay so i'm also going to make up uh five of these on the side uh just to keep us um nice and hydrated okay cool and then i'll take this stuff because that is definitely going to clog up our output uh you can only stack them up to 15 yeah cool all right so uh this should be done now let's take a quick look here i'm going to put my meat away so i don't smell in the track of zombies nice and now i know guys i can use the organize button up in the left corner but i honestly hate that button for my personal inventory uh for boxes no problem 
Because boxes are huge, there's a lot of space in them and they can be kind of irritating. But honestly, if you can't organize your inventory with this much space, <laughs> use that button, I guess. But this is how I like it. I like to use like my long-term stuff, like my repair stuff all up in the top, and then kind of like my goofy stuff down in the bottom. Um, I don't know. It's just the way I am, I guess. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and grab that cement mixer. It should be done now. Nice, it's done. Uh, we also have that bucket that I'll probably never use. Ooh, I should repair this. Let's go ahead and repair that as well. So we're going to put the cement mixer, I think, maybe back up here. And we're going to take a quick look at our fertilizer now, now that we can start making fertilizer. So for fertilizer, one fertilized ground, or uh, one fertilizer, you actually got to use a hole on the ground to fertilize it. Uh, you need 10 dirt fragments, 15 nitrate powder, and 10 rotting flesh. So fertilizer, guys, is not cheap to make. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab whatever nitrate we might have. We have 491, uh, our dirt fragments, and then our winner of all of them, rotting flesh. So we only have enough to make like four things of fertilizer. And it takes forever. One fertilizer takes 15 minutes. Uh, so this is going to be working for an hour now. A whole hour, just a, an hour and three, four minutes to make four fertilizers. So yes, that is something good to make when you don't really have anything else in, in your cement mixer to, to make, right? Um, I don't have any cement or anything going yet, so uh, it's the best time to make it is right now is when I'm absolutely not using it. Uh, this is turned off, so we're good to go there. I only like to have so many machines because this will add to the heat uh, the heat map as well too when I explain that to you guys. The heat map's not actually heat, it's how much your attention you're getting, how much noise you're making, right? Alright, so I think we got everything we needed to do right here and right here. We still got some time, so you know what? We're going to head back to the city and get ourselves 15 more mechanical parts. Uh, but this time, the difference is, is I'm actually, you know what? This wood can stay here, I'll put it in my supplies box. And these wood spikes, we seem to be using them anyway, so I may as well use them up. There we go. Perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and go into my supplies chest here. And I'm going to grab myself a puffer jacket. And we're going to wear that sucker because we got awfully cold last time. And the puffer does like a 40% to your health. So, yeah. Uh, now hopefully we can make it there and make it... Fuck, I'm going to be hitting my traps all the time. Uh, make it back in time for nightfall, but I highly doubt it. If that's the case, then I'll just spend the, the night on the roof of a building and maybe grind stuff I just randomly... I don't know. We'll see. I'll see you guys over there. All right, so we are headed to the south end of the city now. And just as a note, guys, do not use this for stamina. Do not use your beer for stamina like you did in the... Um, uh, like previous patch 10 because honestly it is the only thing that'll give you stun immunity and it gets you out of some sticky ass situations you know what I mean okay so we haven't seen this end of the city and it looks actually pretty barren this city is big there's a lot of roads but there's actually not that much in it I think I see a store over there do I see a store or something we can go take a look always search these cars as well here too here we go what do we got oh an auger part nice Sick! We got our first auger part. That's fucking awesome. You know what? A hunting we go. Oh, a little short. That's right. I forgot about the arc. Okay. Ah, fuck that pig. Fuck that pig. God, pretty mouth. Let's go and oh, fuck these. It's all destroyed homes. This is so unfortunate. Burnt out homes, which is a little weird too. I didn't think the burnt out homes come in the um the snow biomes but whatever it is what it is right okay so we got a gas station oh nice that's a good gas station too i want to show you guys um this object that's at this gas station someone else has brought this up too uh but i want to show you guys let's go over this way uh so we'll uh, break through the back fence here i got my new fancy iron pickaxe or axe that's repaired oh shit look at this i forgot it was all barbed wire and shit back here so let's flex and bust through this barbed wire. Hopefully there's no zombie surprises back here. And there is this thing. Where where to it go? It's on the ground in here somewhere. I know it is for a fact. Ah, here it is. This little contraption right here. Uh, this here is called a pole top in the XML files, in the actual files themselves. That's what they call this, is a pole top. So we're going to go ahead and scrap this thing down. One mechanical part. Two mechanical parts. Three, four mechanical parts. 
There we go. Four mechanical parts. Um, as far as I know, that thing can actually give you up to six mechanical parts. It's one of the, the highest um, items that, that puts stuff out for you. Uh, but unfortunately, let's pick up the gas barrel. Pick up this gas barrel. I don't want any explosions going on. Oh, shit. There's a, there's a shopping cart back here, too. Let's grab that baby up. Because all we need is, like, 15 more parts, guys. That's all we need. We seem to be fine in here for now, too. We have a lot of attention, but it is what it is. Oh, sick. That shopping cart put out for us, too. What do we have now? Seven parts. Awesome. Oh, okay. Well, it looks like we got a, a few friends coming our way now. They've managed to make it in. I've called the city in. Uh, I don't think there's much in this gas station that I can take apart, but we may as well since we're here, right? Okay. Come here, zombie. Maybe I should take out the smaller ones here first before, before anything else because they're easier. Oh, I was going to say, did I one-shot her? That would have been sick. Fuck, his shoulder got in the way. You asshole. Nope. Nope. There we go. One more to the head, and she should be down. Whoops. If I can aim. Ah, son of a bitch. She wasn't stunned anymore. Ah, fuck these guys. Fuck these guys. You know what? Eat those spikes, assholes. There we go. That might, uh, might help break their legs and, and make it a lot easier to take them out. There we go. Is this the one I already did a lot of damage to? Better not be, because you just ate my spike. These things break easier now, too, guys. Just to mention, if you guys didn't notice, like, they break down real quick. Uh, they aren't really good for a permanent defense anymore. Uh, just because of how fast they break down and how many of them you have to make. Bam! You know what? You know what else we can do? We can have some fun. We can, uh, we can go like this, place down a gas barrel. Oh, we only have seven mechanical parts. Damn it. Break down the gas barrel. Go like that. Oh, she's laying beside it. And suck it. What? Suck it. Ah. <laughs> oh, that wasn't very smart. Now it was a big guy. I love that he did it for me. Did they change it so the gas barrels don't blow up with um, arrows as well now, too, on, on console? Because that was an Alpha 16 thing where they added that in. I think there's just a small chance of it happening. I think that's how that works. Jesus Christ, I'm taking my time with these guys here. This guy took a gas barrel. He took fucking a lot. He's a tough little fucking asshole. There we go. Try to get some shots in on his head while he's down. Okay. I know I'm risking it, but it's worth it. Ah, shit, son of a bitch. All right. God damn these lumberjacks. I swear, guys. I swear. Fuck it. Cut. Finally. Holy shit, frozen lumberjack. I have not had any of these lumberjacks give me anything good yet. I've killed a few, but none of them have uh, put out for me. All right, awesome. So you guys want to watch in here as well, too, once you get in here. Uh, but a small hint. I'm sure a lot of you know this by now because this is an old POI. Uh, but if you break out one of these stairs... There's usually something hiding underneath it. Ah, it's just a garbage bag this time. But, hey, everything helps, right? Actually, you know what? If one comes in here, I'm going to use that pit to my advantage and, and um, trap them in there and kill them. Ah, oh, sick. Look at that. We found some food. Let's eat that right away, actually. Nice. Go ahead and scrap that. Check out this stuff here. Ah, oh, some more duct tape. I hate making duct tape, guys. So every time I find them, I get pretty pumped about it. No mining helmet? No mining helmet. Damn it. I want a better level mining helmet. Holy shit! Oh, hello, buddy. I didn't know there was one of you in there. Come here. Come over here. I'm gonna bring you uh, over to the spike pit over here. Will you, will you come into the spike pit? No? No? Come on. Come into the spike pit, bud. Right over here. Ooh, look at that. He's actually avoiding the spike pit. Maybe it's because I'm not in it? I don't really want to get in the spike pit, though. That's probably not the best idea. Maybe I can make him stumble into it? Or maybe not? P keep pumping fucking arrows into his head? Whatever. Uh, you know what? This actually has one of these. This will give us mechanical parts as well. Okay, there's nothing in there. You son of a bitch. Come here. I don't want to play Ring Around the Rosie with you right now. I want to get some looting done here. Nice. There we go. Okay, no more challenge. So what I think I'm going to have to do, guys, is I think I'm going to have to spend the night on the roof of this building. So I'm going to go ahead. 
knock out this door because there's stairs right here and I should be fine. What I'll do is I'll go up and just knock out that bottom ladder. Uh, we should be okay for the night. But I do want to get whatever I can in here that's going to put out the mechanical parts for me. Damn, that's a shame. I was hoping we would get back to the, uh, the base here tonight. Okay, you know what, guys? Fuck it. I'm actually going to head home. What we're going to do is we're actually going to take out one of these gas pumps and see if they drop mechanical parts. I never thought about the uh, the gas pumps. Let's go ahead and give her a go here. Oh, we got some electronic components from it. Or parts. My bad. And I don't see any mechanical. Yeah, it didn't give us any mechanical. That's a shame. We did drop some stuff though, which is actually our electronic components. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and scrap that because I still need to upgrade to the, um, the other parts as well. You know what? Fuck this car. I'm going to scrap it down and hopefully it gives us a uh, fuck. You know what? Screw it, guys. I'm going to go home because I can get some stuff down there uh, for tonight. And I think pretty much call this an episode here, guys. I was hoping to get to the, the drawbridge this time around, uh, but that doesn't seem like it's going to be a thing. Anyways, guys, stay classy, always survive, and I will see you in the next episode. Have a good one. Enjoy your gaming.